Now, whether you buy from a liquor store, a bar, or a restaurant, how you purchase alcohol in New Mexico is about to change. ABC 7's Kate Pierre explains why it's now easier for restaurants to get full liquor licenses and why the business owners who already have them are beyond frustrated. She reports from our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom. The owner of Dry Point Distillers hopes he'll have a wave of new customers after local restaurants buy his spirits. I'm hoping that'll be really good for our business. I'm hoping it'll be really good for other restaurants and other businesses that have been kind of suffering. You can't get fresher than this. Based in Mesilla, Dry Point Distillers brings liquor from farm to liver. The big guys aren't going to use blue corn in their whiskey. Hopefully a, a good economic driver across the board. Starting this summer, restaurants with a beer and wine license only have to pay $500 more to serve hard liquor made in New Mexico. For $10,000, restaurant owners like Russell Hernandez of Salud de Mesilla can get their full liquor license. A lot of guests that they come in and they, they want to have a martini with dinner or they want to have a real margarita with their dinner. And when I can't provide that side of the experience, I usually end up going somewhere else. <laughs> Alcoholic drinks at Salud have a wine base to them, so Russ right now is making a mojito with a wine-based rum. I think it's a great thing. You know, I'm really, really looking forward to seeing what they're doing here and what all the local businesses are going to be doing. <laughs> but not everyone's happy with the law. Do you feel that your license has been devalued? Oh, it has. There's no doubt about it. This was an enormous swing in a very short period of time. Tom Hutchinson paid half a million dollars for two liquor licenses at two separate restaurants, including La Posta de Mesilla. Before this law, there were a limited number of licenses in the state, and the price was based on demand. Hutchinson invested hundreds of thousands of dollars because... Uh, we wanted to serve a real honest to goodness margarita. I love making margaritas. It's actually my passion. But now... For the most part, you can buy the license I have today for $10,000. So restaurants across New Mexico are celebrating, except those with a full bar already, like La Posta. Reporting from Mesilla with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom, Kate Berry, ABC7. We'll get through this together. Thank you for doing your part.